In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use the CAD system for Blaine County DPS. So to access the CAD, the CAD system, you will need to log into the website. And as you can see, I'm already logged in. And you're going to look under the Dispatch tab, and you're going to select the Dispatch system. It's going to take you to our Google Drive. And you'll have to have access to the CAD system before you can uh, view it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to log in on the community account. And then it will bring up the CAD system. So, as you can see, pending calls, there's a number, and there's the time at the top right. And then we've got two types of sections on this dispatch center. We have 911 calls, and then we have the unit board. And the unit board is for the sheriff's office and for the fire department. On the calls, you'll have the time, the status, the agency, location, call type, call notes, dispatch time, arrival time, and clear time. This is, these times are all needed for the units whenever they have to do a report. They'll ask for these num uh, the times. So, I'm going to explain how this system works. So, if we was to get a 911 call, you're going to put the time of the call and then you can hit tab and it's going to directly go over to the next field and then you're going to set the status to pending and you can just type in PE and then hit tab and it's automatically going to count pending and then what type of agency so if it's fire you would type in F and it would come up fire and if it's for sheriff you type in S and then tab it over and then for the location, um, we have all, all the locations in San Andreas in this system. Um, so if it happened, if the call is happening at, let's say, 4401, or let's do 402 Procopio Promenade at the Bayview Lodge at room 1 and it's going to be a domestic. So the call types go by the TIN code. So the TIN code for a domestic is a 1041 and then you can choose from verbal, physical, a neighbor dispute verbal, or a neighbor dispute physical. Or you can just type in domestic and it's going to come up the options for you to select. So if it was verbal I'm going to select that and it's going to be yellow. And then if it's physical, it's going to change it to red. So the different type of call will get a different priority. And then there's a section for call notes where you can type in. So I'm going to put between the caller and his wife. And that would be the 911 call. So then, whenever I would dispatch this call out, I would change the status to dispatched and I would put the time that the call was dispatched in. Whenever the unit arrives on scene, I would put the time that they arrived on scene and then change the status to on scene. Whenever the unit's clear, same thing, put the time in, change the status to clear. Over here we've got the unit board so the administration is set 147, 112, and 223 that's the administration uh, officers for the sheriff's office and if you've got them in service again the 10 code is 108 and it means available and let's say 112 is 106 and 223 is 108 if for some reason one of these units keys up something such as a traffic stop if you don't know the TIN code you can type in traffic stop 
and it comes up it's a 1081 and you're going to select that and then for the notes you can put what they're out on and normally I would put what road they're out on so let's say 147 keyed up and said that he was at Joshua Road go on down here's the fire units um, you can select them for out of service busy available bathroom responding routine respond emergency and on scene and you can do that as well with the units by selecting um, this is our dispatch center um, another thing that the dispatch uh, center also has is report numbers whenever uh, deputies are out on calls um, such as crashes or if they're arresting somebody they're gonna need to get a report number so if a unit calls in that they need a report you're gonna go down here to the report number section and it's gonna come up the reports what I what I would do is I would go down and the next number that's available so if a unit was requesting a crash report number you're going to give them the the next number that's empty so let's say 147 was requesting a crash report number so I'd put 147 in and his report number would be 23 so I'd tell him that his report number was 23 and that is how um, you would use the CAD system for Blaine County DPS